G'day, it's Robbie again. Well, the handle fell off one of my little favourite little screwdrivers that I had. It had a wooden handle on the end and it just disintegrated from old age. It was, you know, ancient. And it was a nice little screwdriver. Okay, screwdrivers, you get them cheap, I know, but it's a pity when one of your favourite things falls apart. And you see how small it is compared to a box of matches, you know. It's uh, not very big. And I thought, well, you know, you could probably make up a wood, another wooden end and stick on it. And then I thought, it'd be nice if it had an aluminium um, end on it, you know, and maybe even, maybe even knurl it, you know. Um, so uh, I'm going to have a crack at it. Um, see if I can cast an aluminium end onto this and then a cylinder of aluminium. Make it longer than you need to be so you can grip it and I might be able to knurl it. Um, although my nail may not get into it, you know, that closely, we'll see. So, uh, of course, you've got to, when you cast it, how do you keep it straight, you know? Obviously, you're going to cast a cylinder of aluminium. How do you keep the, the shaft straight in the, in the aluminium? Well, I thought about it for a while, over a couple of beers. And I think I've come up with an idea on how to do it, so I'm going to give it a crack and it'll either work or fail. So, we'll see what happens. Clean her up and try and machine it. There we go. Now get get a bit of wood off first, I suppose. Yeah. There we go. We're on the way. Here we get on.
There you go. A little, uh, oops, take that out. A nice little screwdriver, all cast in. Just have to take a little rough edge off on the linish here. Polish the end up. I'll leave that with a, uh, with a dead centre went in there. It won't matter. I'll just polish it up on the linish here and, uh, there's that for home casting and machining, eh? Not too bad. So the old screwdriver. Can't make your life. We need an old blow lamp to uh, melt down some aluminium and uh, uh, where you go. Okay, I hope you found it interesting. I didn't do any audio on this because there's a lot of noise going on with the neighbours around the place. And I'll, uh, I'll leave it to your imagination to see what I'm doing. Okay, see you next time. Cheers.